The Rainbow Wahine Track and Field Team is hosting the WAC Championships Tuesday, May 10th through Friday, May 13th. Admission on Tuesday and Wednesday is free. Tickets for Thursday and Friday's events are available for single-day purchase as well as two-day packages. You're the school record holder in the triple jump and own the top mark in the WAC this season. What's your goal for this year's WAC championship? Um, my goal is to do as good as I can. I think right now I'm ready to actually do better than I did last two years. And like obviously my goal is to hit 13 meters mark and um, to PR, which would be 13, 22 over. And that would place me number one, hopefully. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Having competed in the SEC in Florida prior to coming to UH, what's the biggest adjustment competing in Hawaii and the West region? Mm. Well, they say that SEC is a little, little stronger conference. But in my event, like, for example, last year it was as strong as it was in SEC, so it's almost the same. Um, otherwise, sprint events are like stronger, faster in SECs, but otherwise I don't see a big difference. The WAC Championships will be here at the Clarence T.C. Ching Field for the first time since 2006. Why should fans come out to this event? Because it's going to be amazing. <laughs> Yeah, come see us winning some events. We'll see how we'll place this year. But it's it's going to be pretty amazing. Like so many teams are coming here and I'm pretty sure they will be really happy to do very good results here in Hawaii. You're the defending WAC outdoor champion in the discus and currently ranked second in the WAC this season. Is there any pressure to repeat as a champion? Um, I think there's a little bit of pressure on me just to get that number one spot again because I definitely think it's like within my grasp and um, WAX is a really important uh, event as far as um, other track events so yeah I'd say there's quite a bit of pressure. <laughs> you haven't quite reached your potential yet this season in the discus. Do you feel having the WAC championships here on your home turf will help you get over that hump? Um, I think it's it's probably a little bit of an advantage because um, this is where we practice. Um, I mean, we practice in a different ring, so we're probably getting uh, the same amount of uh, help as even any other team. But uh, all in all, I think it comes into comes to up to how well um, your, how good your technique is and um, whether you can do it on the day. So. You also set a personal best in the shot put this season. What is your goal in that event? Um, as far as shot put goes, my main focus is discus. Um, so uh, I'm just looking to throw as best I can, uh, make top eight at least, um, so get some points for the team. But yeah, I'm hopefully set a personal best. Why should the fans come out to this event? Um, I think it's it's a new experience. It'd be it would be a great experience for. Um, People in Hawaii, it's it's something that doesn't have happen often. Uh, more people tend to go to baseball and uh, football games, so uh, and having as much support as we can would definitely increase our chances of uh, doing a lot better. And support's always nice. <laughs> Volunteers are needed to help out with the various phases of the meet. Contact Thea Belgrave at her email. Different time slots are available, and any help is appreciated. Come on out to Les Marikami Stadium this weekend to cheer on our Rainbows as they take on San Jose State in their last home series of the season. Sunday is senior night, so come on out to give your aloha to our seniors. That's all we have this week. Hope to see you in the stands. For more information, check out our website at hawaiiathletics.com or become a fan on our Facebook and Twitter page.